kiss for you. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development and so guys in this video I am going to show you how to blur a whole layout in your Android application. So basically uh, there were many APIs which were just blurring the image and putting that into the image view but in this video I am going to show you how you can just blur a, a whole layout and so let's get started so first of all i want to show you a, a library which i have just found and that is blur view and it's like dy dynamic ios like blur of uh, underlying views for android all right so basically if you want to blur your whole layout without any image or image view so this library is for you so i decided to make the video and okay so now in this video i am going to show you to blur the background so let's get started so so here we will have here the build or gradle and first of all here we we can copy the uh, dependency so we will just copy that and paste it here and now you now you just need to click on sync now and yes yes now it is easily uh, integrated into our project the next thing is now we need to go to our uh, activity main.xml and here we will uh, we will have the blur layout all right and let's set the id to blur layout all right and now we need to have a layout which we want to blur so for that first of all i will show i will uh, here we have this i have this layout which i will uh, i will blur it so for that i will just copy it and paste it here so now we have this all these things inside our let me remove this and okay so here we have all our layout and right after at the end of this layout we have this blur view okay so now it will blur the layout but we need to do the processing in our main activity dot java file so how can we do that so first of all we need to have initialize our blur view and let's say blur view find view by id and we can say blur layout okay so now here we can write a method that will blur the layout so for that we can say blur background and let's create this method so uh, press alt enter if you are using windows and there it uh, now we have this method what we can do now is let's go down there and okay so now let's just copy this and paste it here and you need to just remove the comments from there okay so we need to integrate this render script blur okay so now there is we have 20 f that is the radius of the blur the maximum value is 25 so let's just have 22 or let's just say 21 all right so that is it let me now show you the output so for that let me open the side sync app and let me show you the output and now here we have the side sync uh, yes now let's run our app and let's see the blood layout effect in our android background layout so yes
all right guys so now you can see that it has blurred this whole uh, background okay so if you want uh, that you don't need to blur something in the uh, in the layout and you just want to blur a particular view so for that what we can do is here we can have uh, okay so whatever thing you don't need to blur you need to put that into this blur view so for this we can have a button let's say and all right so that is the button and also we can have another button that will be and let's set the text to blurred button and let's paste it here I am not getting this okay so you just need to have these two buttons here uh, and let's have linear layout and right inside our linear layout we will have these two buttons and it will be vertical and there we have these two buttons and let's also set the text okay so now we have these these two buttons which we don't want to blur and now let's see what does it do okay so now you can see that it has blurred this whole layout but it has not blurred these two buttons alright guys so I hope that you have understood understand that how you can blur a whole layout instead of any image or image view so guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe goodbye